friends, it's me, Savannah. I'm gonna be showing you how to get these loose curls all from a flat iron. I'm using the QT Performance Diamond Ceramic Flat Iron. It's a one inch, and this will be perfect for uh, the, the look we're going for. And I have it at 140 degrees. First things first, you are going to wanna make sure that your hair is completely dry. If you straighten and curl your hair, whatever you do when it's wet, it will damage it. Uh, so make sure that your hair is completely dry. Okay, so first thing you're gonna do is take just a small piece. You're not gonna wanna use thick, thick sections. Um, use about this much, can, can you see? <laughs> uh, it will just take up kind of like my whole nail. Um, basically, I'm just going to move it forward for a few seconds. Do you see how it kind of creates that bend? Um, now I'm gonna do it the other way. I'm gonna pull the hair and make it go this way. Do the same thing over here. And do the same thing right here. And you kind of get this little wave. It kind of looks crimped, it kind of looks wavy. Um, it'll be really cool once we finish. So let's continue. We're gonna take another section up here. Just start it again at the root. Hold it for a few seconds. Not for too long, because we don't want that thing to happen where your hair falls off. You've seen her type before. She knows what she can. Hold it for a few seconds, and then pull your hair and do it the other way. But it never the other way. And that piece. Take another section. She lights me up to watch me burn and still I come back. Now we're back down to the wild. No, I should not play with fire. You're going to continue taking pieces from the back and just kind of pull them to the front. Uh, you don't need to be precise and like pull your hair up. Sometimes when I curl my hair, I put half of it up and then curl it. And this is just kind of messy and it's just going to look very um, natural. So you don't need to take that much time with it. Continue to pull forward, hold for a few seconds and then pull that piece and pull the opposite way. Hold that piece and move forward. Once you start getting to the right side of your head using your left hands. I'm a righty so this is kind of tricky for me. So I'm just going to take a little chunk and use my right hand still. And just pull forward, pull for a few seconds, pull that piece as you move it away, pull that piece and move it away. Okay, so once you are all finished covering your whole head, you're just gonna put your hands underneath your hair and kind of go like this, go crazy, do it on the top, and then spray. I'm gonna use Big Sexy Hair Spray, which I love, and it uh, keeps my hair in place for hours and hours. So I'm just gonna pull my hair up and spray. Do it to the same side. <laughs> it looks like a lion. And then just kind of smooth out the top so there's not a ton of flyaways. This is a good look for the summer and uh, when you just want to look like you didn't do much to your hair but you still kind of put some time and effort into it. Um, I love this hairstyle and it's very fun and easy and I just love the way it looks. So let me know what you thought in the comments below and I'll see you next Sunday. Bye guys. Number nine is Essie Nail Polish. Woo. I love